Blanchline College has a rich but complicated history. Consequently, when the current principal, Rob O'Brien, started at the college in 2016, he received into his care a school of 305 students without a sick form and without a library for the secondary school. He immediately resolved to establish both because, as he says, both A-level studies and a vibrant library act as catalysts for academic endeavor throughout the school and were therefore essential for the school. Today, we have 464 students on our roll, a thriving sixth form and a library that is integral to the educational process. The college opened its newly built secondary school library in September 2020 to coincide with the induction of its first cohort of sixth form students a truly historic moment in, the, in a history that can be traced back to the 12th century. I have the honor of being appointed as the college's first librarian and head of the inquiry-based learning department, which is centered in the library. It is testament to the college's commitment to inquiry as a stance and process within a GCSE and A-level educational pathway, as well as the effectiveness of the library's inquiry-centered instructional program that Blancheland recently appointed its second professionally qualified librarian. The IFLA School Library Guidelines envision a library that is integral to the educational process, which it becomes through its inquiry-centered instructional program. Inquiry is a stance of wonder and puzzlement that gives rise to our dynamic process of coming to know and understand the world and ourselves in it as the basis for responsible participation in community. To develop into fully engaged and empowered inquirers, two things are necessary. Firstly, a sound instructional model of the inquiry process and underlying framework of inquiry skills, which we have in Fossil. Secondly, to develop these skills systematically and progressively within subject area of teaching and learning. Our priority, therefore, was to establish an interdisciplinary signature work inquiry in transition years or phases these are now in place for year one, year six, year nine, and year 12. These signature work inquiries have served both to embed priority inquiry skills in these transition years or phases, and as a foundation for inquiry-based work in other subjects and years. Because the process of learning about the world through the subjects that students are studying is heavily dependent on reading, both non-fiction and fiction, Timetabled reading is a distinguishing feature of our signature work inquiries. Crucially, this has reversed the worrying trend for reading in year nine to dramatically drop off, and it underscores the fact that reading to learn about something that you are genuinely interested in can be pleasurable. Blancheland is a reading school, and the library's purpose is enabling knowledge and understanding of the world and ourselves in it through reading. To support and promote recreational reading, we offer regular reading lessons with a range of exciting reading challenges in years seven and eight, alongside displays, competitions, and author events. In December 2021 and 2022, we surveyed students on their attitudes towards reading and used for libraries to take out books. In December 2021, the survey found that student enjoyment of reading was 5% lower than that identified as the average of the National Literacy Trust Survey. In December 2022, this was 11% higher. We also found that 10% more students reported regular use for library to take out books. Being shortlisted for this award is a testament to the vision and hard work of our library-based inquiry team and their deep collaboration with other teaching staff and students. Our vision when building a library was to create a space that facilitates liberal education in its truest sense students capable of independently inquiring into their subjects and to question perceptively and to think deeply. The key to realising this was the creation of an inquiry-based department within the library, which is naturally home to the spirit of inquiry. As this academic year draws to a close, it is tremendous to see students speaking knowledgeably and confidently articulating not only what they have discovered, but also the method by which they have arrived there.